the video went off on me or something, y'all. I don't know what happened, but you see, we in the car. I'm trying to record for y'all, and everything happened, but <laughs> we're going to get through this. And I see some men right now, so I hope those are the men that are here to fix my soul. Oh, I gotta cook. I'm hungry. All right. All right. So let's just get back on topic. Um, just my mission here, you guys. My mission and my purpose is to help heal and help you. Okay. Is to incur encourage those that look just like me, that are just like me. Um. And what do I mean, just like me? <laughs> Not perfect, with faults. I mean, I'm talking about those people. Different, those that um, you may call me weird. Yeah, a little, okay. Spiritual, yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. Um, empaths, people that I've dated men and women. Hey, okay. I've learned many things. I've had love, happiness. You know, I've been through many trials and tribulations. I've experienced experienced abandonment shit. You know, I've been toxic my damn self. You know, like I am here to help you heal in, in whichever way that that means. Right? And God said, use your voice. I was like, hmm. Mm, mm. Okay, God. Okay. So, each and every day, I am led by my instinct, by my gut feeling, each and every day to come on here and to talk to you guys. And from one, and from day one to this moment, I can really say that I chose the right direction. Not because I'm healed entirely, but because I'm healing and I'm being, I'm becoming more aware of who I am in order to help someone else be who they want to be or who they are, who they truly are, their highest self. My company's foundation, and I mean that from my heart. Is so much built on unconditional love, betterment, encouragement, healing. And I say that a lot, healing, 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 because it is a wide uh, aspect of healing. This person may be dealing with trauma from a seven years old, from molestation or something. This one over here is dealing with um, the death of a father or a mother, you know, or a grandparent. Healing it comes in all different shapes, forms, and fashions. And I can just sit here and tell you guys that it feels good, it is worth it, and it is worth the push. It's worth the push each and every day. Every day. To get up and to be able to just first be able to get up and know that you have another chance. And somebody else did not make it. And that there's a bigger plan for you. There's, it's, it's another reason. It's a reason why you're here. You're still here. As much as we, we want to give up, I'm the one to talk about suicidal thoughts, okay? Having anxiety and depression. You guys know that, that those three alone are very serious. So to be able to get over that, and I'm not fully over it, but I have worked so much to where that's not my first thought is some people out there that understand that's their first thought you i was you you was me that's your first thought now it's my last thought it's like 50 thoughts of positivity in between that 
And that's what I want to teach you guys. That's what I want to help you understand that it's okay. Uh, these videos that you hear, it may be corny. You know what I'm saying? I understand the corniness. Like, damn, you want us to be probably jolly? But Miss Phoenix I ain't never been fake with jolly. And every day ain't holly jolly. But you got to make it holly jolly so you can get through the day. Okay? And that's what I'm here to help you guys with. All right? Um, let me see what else I got. So, you know, I talk about angel numbers. I talk about energy. I talk about the chakras. I talk about spirituality, like we just talked about. Sometimes it comes in and out. Anxiety, depression, suicide. Um, but the um, holistic part of the of it you need to be balanced each and every day so you need a balanced day is needed from the inside out okay you guys so you need treatment of the whole body um you need um that means mentally emotionally physically financially intellectually um what else you guys spiritually if i did not say that um So you can address the whole body, the whole person, the entire being. So on, because I want to get on here and talk to you guys on tomorrow about journaling your intentions. Tonight, I'll just say it tonight. Tonight, you guys need to write down what you want to bring in. Tomorrow is a new moon. You need to write down what you want to bring in not too much of what you want to release because the full moon it already passed so the things that 